Uh, we're going to dice an onion right now and you could go online and find dozens of different videos on, on how to cut an onion correctly. I'm going to show you my way. I've been doing this for about 40 years and um, it's a little different than the one you'll find but it works very well. First, you cut the top of it off, then you cut the bottom off, then cut the onion right straight in two, then remove the skin on both sides. If you have a compost, it's perfect for that. The one thing you don't want to do with the onion skin is if you're making a stock, leave the skin out of the stock. You'll, it'll turn your stock very dark if you use onion skin in it. Then once you get it to this, this point, um, cut through the onion, going down, straight down but angling in towards the center of the onion till you get to the top, then go straight down. Angle on the sides again. Now, a fine dice. And the other side. Angling in, straight down, just like that. Angling in. Always curl your fingertips under for safety. There you go, one perfectly diced onion, my way. Always important when you're doing this to tuck your fingers in. Some people like to use their fingernails as a um, edge. I like to use the back of my knuckle right there. A sharp knife is much safer than a dull knife. If a dull knife slips off, it's gonna hit what's next to what you're cutting, and that's probably gonna be your finger. Seems kind of counterintuitive, but a sharp knife, it won't slip off of what you're cutting, and it almost guides itself. The Broad and Taylor Knife Sharpener. Sharp made simple.